All right, I'll take a quick look at this Sky RC. Aries Pro V3 motor. This is the one I used in that uh, Enduro project. And <clears throat> I got it because it would be a, a low current draw. It would be good for running, you know, long runs with that type of thing. Um, I've actually been really impressed with... Um, with the quality of the motor overall, but I think I'm going to take it apart and take a look at the way it's uh, assembled, and you can look along too and see what this uh, reasonably priced motor is, how it's really built. screws out probably find some dirt because I didn't blow this motor out so there's probably some dirt in there too steel screws and the front section the shim in there nice machined aluminum case Pull out this rotor. Oh, really strong magnets. Oh, I can get a hold of it. There it is. This guy RC. SK four zero 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 three zero dash oh four as a rotor number. Like I said, really strong magnet. That's a sensor board. See that in the back. Now, okay. It doesn't look like I'd be able to just slide this case completely apart. But it is a three piece unit. You see the timing marks. I had this one set at 40 degrees. But yeah, very well built for the uh, for the price. Get these on uh, Amazon or through uh, rcjuice.com. A lot, lot cheaper than the big name brands. Let's see if I can get this in there without damaging something or hurting myself. 
That is a strong magnet. Shim. So I'm going to take some fiddling to get everything lined back up. Put the screws back in it. Should be good to go again. Well, I think that's enough of this. But yeah, well-made motor.